Business owner turning to the public for help after he says $50,000 worth of bricklaying equipment was stolen from his company. The Sedgwick County Sheriff's Office says the theft happened on a gated property just outside of Wichita on 143rd Street East between 13th and 21st. New at 10, Cakes Madeline Anderson is here with details about the crime. Hey, Madeline. Well, this is the stolen 27 foot long trailer belonging to Tony Lair Mason Reconstruction. The owner is hoping someone will come forward who's seen it since it went missing this past weekend. These guys knew exactly what they were doing. All that's left of Tony Lair's brick lane business are a couple of buckets, a shovel, and a broken chain. I don't know what we're going to do. Lair says thieves cut the lock on his trailer Sunday morning, then drove right off the property with it and everything that was inside. I'm probably going to be somewhere around 50000 in scaffolding and trailer, saws, diamond blades, um, all my small hand tool equipment gone everything his case is one of eight trailer thefts around the county since the beginning of the year the sheriff's office doesn't have any suspects but investigators are reviewing nearby surveillance video for possible leads i hope somebody has seen it and can contact authorities immediately it's been three days now, but we're still keeping our fingers crossed. In the meantime, Lair says his family and his employees' families are hurting. Insurance only covers part of the loss, so his team won't be able to get back to work until they find replacement tools. People that steal from uh, companies like this, that that is our livelihood, they'll gain a little bit, but we lose more than, than they can imagine. And the sheriff's office says the best way to secure a trailer is to keep it locked inside a shed. If you don't have access to a shed, chaining it to something outside will at least make it more difficult to steal.